In the previous checkpoint, we briefly touched on enzyme specificity. In this checkpoint, we will further explore enzyme specificity. Enzyme specificity, I just did that three times, can be divided into two kinds, absolute specificity and group specificity. Absolute specificity is when an enzyme catalyzes a single specific reaction. For instance, the enzyme maltase can only catalyze the conversion of maltose into glucose. It can't catalyze anything else. The enzyme does this by recognizing the structure of maltose. Absolute specificity is normally the case when the active site of the enzyme is complementary in structure and charge to a particular substrate. Group specificity, on the other hand, is when an enzyme catalyzes a specific type of reaction, a certain group, for example. For example, the enzyme chymotrypsin catalyzes the breakage of a polypeptide into smaller fragments for a wide range of proteins. This is not done at random. It does this by recognizing specific amino acids and cleaves the peptide bond directly after it. Group specificity is normally the case when the active site of the enzyme is complementary in structure and charge to a particular chemical bond. So you can think of it as absolute recognizes the whole substrate, while group recognizes what's in the substrate. 